through. Now is on, we're ready to run here in the sixth event for Maitland. There's that away and run. He came out good. Treeman Shelby leading it as Barb's Pixie across from the outside. Effective arrow. Treeman Shelby got to a handy third around that first turn. They were followed further back by Barb Voss on the outside there was Sassy Swiper, Mr. Honey Badger, Snowy Garura. And last as they straighten up Fashion Queen around the turn for him. And bowling along in front. Barb's Pixie effective on the outside is Treeman Shelby. Treeman Shelby went home and beat Barb's Pixie. Snowy Garura are on the outside. Mr. Honey Badger, Fashion Queen. And then came uh, back in the field behind those runners there was uh, Fashion Queen uh, with Snowy Guerrera. And back there with them was Effective Arrow. Number one, the winner, Tree Men Shelby. Tackled the leader strongly halfway down the straight and has gone home too good for them by Jarvis Bale at a full-on Shelby. And then trained by Louise McGee, defeating number two, Barb's Pixie. Lock and Var Marlow, Strathaven did for Warren Kelly. And six has run third, Mr. Honey Badger, Cape Hawk, multi cam girl for Chris Kedwell. One and three quarters, four and a quarter, fourth home number three, Snowy Guerrera. So those numbers, one, two, six, and three. That run home time, 6.69. And that run of 22.60, one and three quarters by four and a quarter. And that winner on the total pay, $1.40. Nice win to the favourite, Treeman Shelby. One forty and $1.20. Buzz Pixie, three twenty. Six Mr. Honey Badge at $2. That's the approximate dividends. The numbers, one, two, six, and three after the sixth event.